Alright, looks like the stream started. We're now stepping away. That's good. That's as planned. We'll get started on Paper Mario in about 14 minutes. Hopefully this time I will not destroy my voice as badly as I did on Wednesday. So, hopefully we'll have a nice, calm, non-voice destroying voice work. Hopefully our Wednesday has been going all right today. Today's tea is the same as uh, as when I was Wednesday, a hibiscus green tea wild berry mix. Uh, only issue I have with it is that a lot of the bits are uh, itty bitty teeny tiny. Uh, and that's an issue because I, it, I'm brewing loose leaf. And, uh, they escaped the uh, basket because of how small they are. But oh well, I tried a coffee filter to see if how that would work. So we'll uh, see how well that did.
Let's see, if my memory recalls, we are heading to your Fort Wars Dry Dry Desert today. Yeah, that sounds about right. Over. Get that up and running. Okay, that's good. Push to dock is working on the controller, thankfully.
Alright, three minutes and we'll get started. about a minute left which is about when the song ends so we'll switch over when the uh song ends Here we go. Gotta make sure everything's working, including my button mapping. Alright, that's working just fine, though the game is a little loud. Let me just turn that down slightly. Hmm. Not showing up in the uh, list. I guess I'll just do a manual turndown on OBS. Ah, uh, let's see. That should be good enough. I was tend to do some off-stream getting coins and whatnot, but I figured, eh. Nah. It's not like... Mario 65, uh, Paper Mario is, uh, requires that kind of grinding. So, let's see, where were we? Right, we were gonna go to, uh... We have a train to free. Oh, wait, I should actually check, make sure there's no new badges. Ah, new badges. Ah... Well, let's see, not, I don't have much in terms of selling, but I can give it a shot. Oh sure, we'll take a quiz. Mm. 
Oh, right, I should actually... I never gave him a voice last time. I kind of got... Sorry, I got distracted. I don't know, I'll do it next time I... Yeah. We come across him, because we will be coming across him several times. But what we want to do... Now that I'm definitely not going to get nothing. Well, the master's in, so we can do that fight. Oh, you must be Mario. Welcome to my dojo. I am the master. I am the head of this dojo. <laughs> Please pardon me, my health is rather delicate. Every day we train at this dojo to improve body and mind. If you have the purpose and the desire, you may challenge us. Tell me, what business you have here today? <laughs> very, very well, but Chan will fight you. Now, <laughs> Chan, it's time for you to fight Mario. As you say, Master. Oh! I'm in danger. Mario! Here comes Chan the Man. Um... Well... I made a technical mistake. I did not realize I did not heal after a uh, last session, so let me take care of that. And then, hey, that gives me a chance to actually redo the voicing for the uh, Christmas guy. Oh, Mario, the turret house slogan is refresh your body and soul. Would you like to make take a nap? Yes. Sleep well. Did you sleep well? Now that your body and soul are refreshed, your travels will seem much easier. He's not there this time. And since I've already voiced all these, just gonna speed right past. Now let's actually try. Oh, I forgot to get the uh, bar just do a tattle. This is this is Chan of the Dojo. He's training under the master. He's happy to fight us. HP 15. Power 2. Defense 2. Hammer attacks don't work well, but you can turn him over with a jump attack. Once he's flipped over, he's easy. No mercy, Mario! Overkill! 
enough. The winner is Mario. Chan, you must train harder. Mario, I give this, give you this, Mario. I got the first degree card. Proof of Mario's strength won by defeating Chan at the dojo. You're welcome here to train with us any time. <laughs> Oh, that peaked. Alright, let's... Go and heal up. So I want to see if I can even take on the next guy. here today. Very well. This time, Lee will fight you. Now, Lee, let me see how you handle Mario. Certainly, sir. I will defeat him, master. I bet you've never seen a move like this before. Lee disguised as me. His max HP is 20. Do I really look like that? No. He used head bog and tattle. He has the same skills as me. Of course, I'm much better looking and more dis- Debonar. Debonair. And I hope that I'm stronger. <laughs> 20, huh? Alright. Nice try. Oh. Oh. You're a strong, I'll give you that. You've never seen a move like this before. Oh. Yay, that worked out. Enough! Mario is the winner! You have much training to do. Very well, I give you this, Mario. Proof of Mario's strength won by defeating Lee at the dojo. Second degree card. You are welcome to train here with us at any time. <laughs> uh, we're not going after the master for a little while at least. At least not with uh, what level we have. No mail. Ah, he's having a good time. Don't want to start him. Headers for Mario. Here, Mario. How do you do? I'm little too. Just a little turd. I live in Turd Town. I've been training at the dojo so I can save Princess Peach. 
I'll write you again later. Bye! Bottle tea. Hello, Mario. I'm Manatee, Chex Quizmo's lovely assistant. Thanks for the participating in our quiz, so our ratings are through the roof. Are those store star pieces helping you? Please keep coming back until you answer the last question. I'll cheer you on. Have a tea. Oh, you, you rat, Mario. How dare you embarrass us. We'll never forget you what you're doing, Red. Hey, watch your back when you walk at night, Black. I'm gonna make you cry, Green. You better sleep with one eye open, pal. Yellow. We shall return, Koopa Bros. I don't know why it takes so long to float that menu, but yep, I could use the key. Mario! I figured out I have an adventure soon. Sooner or later, so I'm training. What's that? Dry-dyed desert? Oh, sure. There's a train that goes down from Toad Town. Hey, maybe I can tag along. No? You sure? Just give me a chance, Mario. Make sure I checked all the bushes. Ah. <sighs> oh, do I want to get the money for these? Uh, what is 65? Oh, no, they're both 75. Never mind. Here lies dark, dark and gloomy forever forest. You'll get lost for sure, so I advise you to not enter. But now I'm curious. Extremely dangerous. Don't you know that? You better go back. I'm Paul Oakley. The forest is my home. I try to keep unprepared people from wandering into the forest and getting lost. The path ahead here is extremely dangerous. Don't you know that? You better go back. Oh, 
this is a piranha friendly. Piranha plants pop out of the ground in at expect unexpected modes, so be on your guard. HP 5, power 3, defense 0. You've seen them in every one of your adventures, so I'd imagine you know them pretty well. Well, actually, there was one adventure we didn't see them in. Their sharp paws point upwards, so you get bitten if you try jumping on them. They smile after biting people, that smug smiling makes me popping mad. Oh, I didn't really. Oh, that's probably what the Daisy Badge does. Got it. Either way. Uh. Race the coins. Oh, there's a blooper down here. We can give that a try. what I needed. This is a Spike Goomba. There's Spike Goombas who live... Oh, Spike Goomba. Who live in Toad Town Tunnels. HP 7, power 3, defense 0. Be careful of the spike paths, they will definitely hurt you if you jump on them. You might have to back out and heal.
Okay. Well, we just saved, so... Though we didn't lose really any progress. We'll skip those guys for the moment. Because, ah, uh, Yep. Gotta let these. This is a blooper! Bloopers look in the dank, dank pools of Toad Town tunnels! HP 30, attack power 3, defense 0. They seem pretty unremarkable, although I have to wonder how they float in the air like that. Back to Gambario then. There we go. Now we're only five away from the next level. Shrink stop. Alright. Uh, let's see. Uh, no VP to put it, them on. Though I would like to get Smash Charge back on. I really should upgrade the HP. up at the Toad House, and we'll get uh, down to the train. I didn't get any coins from the blooper. So it's down here. You know, I haven't seen the old Koopa Trooper lately. He came here often, but he always lost the bundle. Eh, devil. Eh, talk about rotten luck. Smash attack. Hello there, Mario! Welcome to the playroom! To play here, you need a member credit. The kind of game you play depends on the kind of member credit you have. 
no other additional information. Hmm. So we need a member credit. For a huge track is blocking the train tracks. And Peach's castle was uprooted when the boulders from the stack rolled off and landed here. What bad luck. If we can do something about that boulder, we can. I can't make my run to Mount Rugged. I love trains, don't you? I'd love to come here and watch them come and go, but it doesn't seem to move at all now. It's really a more fun to watch when it's moving. The problem must be the giant, gigantic rock in, on the tracks. Didn't mean to talk to you. Ah, no. Mario, you do keep a good supply of items on hand, don't you? If you get attacked when you have nothing, you'll be in a pretty tight fix, huh? My advice is, whenever you're going for a long journey, you should stop by a shop and load up on supplies. I don't have points. I swear one of those shards had an eye on it. The one that landed right here. Oh, thank you, Mario. The train is back on track. Oh, the boy, the train is about to melt rugged. Are you coming, Mario? Yes. The train is about to depart. Please board quickly. I think my voice changed since you talked to me a minute ago. Sit tight, folks. We're de now departing for Mount Rugged. Now's a good time to get something to drink. Chapter 2, The Mystery of Dry, Dry Ruins. Mount Rugged, Mount Rugged! Passengers heading for Dry, Dry Desert or Dry, Dry Output should proceed directly over Mount Rugged from this station. Train's running again. <laughs> oh, about time I can finally get back, go back to Turtle Town. If you want to go to Dry Dry Desert, you have to hike over Mount Rocket. Follow the arrows on the signboards, and you don't get so you don't get lost. There are a lot of scary creatures around here, so if, if you're not careful, you'll get hurt in a big way. If things are looking desperate. You'd better run away really fast. At least I would. Call an egg. Sorry, folks. 
Very sorry. I was looking for something and not watching where I was going. What now? Aren't you Mario? Why, you are! You're the Mario! Ha, well, hello there! The banana, the banana is pericary! I deliver niggers! Um, I'm normally a letter perfect postman, but I'm having a bit of trouble with a lost letter. Wouldn't you know it? I dropped it on Mount Rickon and now I can't find it. If you happen to stumble upon a letter anywhere around here, please tell me, alright? My job could depend on it. I'll be searching this area thoroughly for a while. That yeah, shouldn't be too difficult to find it. Moles are rock growing may moles. Big time mischief makers. Max HP 3, attack 2, and defense 0. Eh, they kind of have a scary looking face. Pretty weak though. Maybe they'll wait. Maybe they wear sunglasses because they really have, have really scissor eyes. Or maybe they just hit. One head bump for you. And extra for just why not? Oh, oh next level regardless. should upgrade my health, but I have badges I want to equip. Another picture perfect day on top of Mount Rugged. <laughs> the sunshine, the fresh air! So refreshing, Wackadoo. Okay, nothing new. So. Heck a ow! Don't hit me! You got a whack a bump. I did not read the description. Okay. 
keep going to the stairs uh, to the menu instead of checking the that. Coins have you given me? Thirty-seven. something accurate, so we need to calculate that. You got a letter! Thank you for finding it. I'm so relieved. Oh, actually, I was only looking for two other letters I may have lost. It wasn't my fault, really. If you could find them, could you? Thank you so much. Oh, more letters. And they respond. This is a cluff! Cluffs are pretty strong, so you better be careful. HP 2, attack 2, and defense 2. Their special is pretending to be rocks, so watch your step on the mountain. You'll get hurt if you jump on their spikes on the heads. You know, there's courage in running away sometimes. Yeah, that's the plan.
I just realized I can't get you there with a pair carry. Shame I didn't realize that. Until after I went that way. He was to go off the ledge. I could squeeze right past him. Well, there went all those coins. Another letter. Nice to sell. Damage dodge. Let's see. If you do the action command, it decreases Mario's damage by one. Okay. That'd be worth it to get equipped. Down to store items. Oh, that's another letter. I think there's stuff back there, but uh, I'm gonna try to beeline it to the town down this way. Because that's blocked off, so I'd have to go all the way back to Toad Town. Oh, 
Well, actually, maybe the other layer's down there, maybe, hopefully. Considering how far back we're going, we'll probably have to oh, might as well just go to the town. Oh, there we go. That's one of the ones I dropped by accident. Thank you for so much, really. Of course, there is still one more level left. If I you can find it too. I'm really scouring this area down here, so but so far I haven't had much luck. The last letter! You found it! Now I've got all the letters I've lost today. Oh, thank you so much. You're a lifesaver. Wish there was some way I could really I could repay you for our help. Yes, I haven't just lost the letters on Mount Rugged. I may have sort of dropped some all over Mushroom Kingdom while I was flying. <laughs> uh, uh, you know, you're good at finding letters. Do you think you keep an eye out during your travels? In return, I could offer you help where I can. Sure. Oh, praise the stars. I wasn't looking forward to having to find those letters all by myself. No, sir. I'll do my very best. You shall not regret this! Harry Curry, join the party! Also, you probably should find a different voice for him! Press down C to have him carry Mario and fly for a short time. He can carry Mario over short gaps that he couldn't jump across by himself. While in battle, he can attack with skydive or smash into enemies using his shell shot ability. Now, onward! Oh, but hey. By the way, if you want to deliver a letter to someone, just speak to that person. I have to be next to you at the time for it to work, though. Keep that in mind, alright? Uh, yeah, we're just gonna go back to Toe Town. Not only to put the eyes, I think there's something I can do back there. Hello, sir! The train is banned for Toad Town Station! Are you coming on board? Hello, bird for Toad Town! If I recall, there is one thing at the docks I can get at the moment. Oh, hey, there's something bugging me about the, uh, the train wheels. The bar... The big bar is going over the pivot point, the center pivot point, whereas the pivot point that's on that bar is... Oh, it was going under at one point. Well, either way, it shouldn't be over anyway. Let's go deposit some items. Oh, wait, there's a shop down here, wasn't there? That's on the way I wanted to go. Hold on. Should there be a lock on that door? items. I'll go back to that in a minute. My 
Back in the Harry shop? How can I help you today? I want to check. That's going in. Yes. Same with the egg. The Koopa leaf. We're on the fright jar. And... Yeah, throw in the honey. It should be good for the moment. Shadow right there. Okay, I did not remember it being a coin block. He's true big fish beginning. We hear now, I fish here. Yeah, all right. Here, caterpillars be making the best bait. Be fuzzy peed, you'll be bait. Jeez, just, just cause, just cause you're all fishing, I got be the bait. Nah, you're not booty. I be be a caterpillar, but I still got some rights. Hmm. Poor guy. Remember that being just a coin block, but oh well. I see anything in the trees. I don't want to talk to you. open must be locked from the inside oh, okay so it's, there's a lock it's just on the inside I can double check to make sure Quizmo's not here uh, let's see yeah still don't have enough money for that I came from flower fields of the wonderful land of flowers. I love to spread the wondrous flowers of flower fields all over your land. You like flowers, don't you? Of course you do. Who doesn't? For that reason, I entrust you this. I trust this to your care. All the buyers will see. This is a flower seed. It is well cared for. A beautiful If it's well cared for, a beautiful flower will bloom. These flowers are delicate. Only one with a loving heart can make them bloom in beauty. Please take good care of it, for beauty is fragile. Uh, actually, Pat, can I just start giving those to, uh, I think there was a toad up here for that. Butter and dirt, sunshine, power, beautiful blooms, and beautiful flowers. Hello, my name is Minnie T. Minty. Please enjoy the beauty of this flower garden. I've heard there's a lovely flower we don't have here. Supposedly, bulbs have the only known seeds. This is what a bulb looks like. If you find a bulb, could you get his get seeds for me? I'll plant them in this flower if you garden and raise them lovingly. Oh, you'll give me the seed? Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I'll plant it right away. Mm 
this is related to an age-old story. You could plant all four of the different colored bulbs, bulb flowers, a miracle will occur. I wonder what will happen. I can hardly wait for that day to come. Alright, let's hit the save. Mount Rugged. Sit tight, folks. Now the party for Mount Rugged. Frickin' has a dream to go. Yep, we already talked. We've had that discussion already. So, I was kind of hoping more points would come out of those. Hammer badge. Spiraling damage enemies. Damage all enemies on the ground or ceiling. Now I just need the uh, BP equip these badges. Oh, I was trying to jump over it. See anyone else here? Yeah, all right, you're talking to me. It's been a long time since I first came here from my home in Flower Fields, but you're still the very first person to speak a word to me. Nobody ever noticed me. The few people I actually see just think I'm blooming. Love a good conversation here. Take this as thanks. This is a precious seed. Keep it well and remember me. You got a magical seed. Please grow my seed with care. I will help you one day. I will help you one day. Hold on, did you just teleport down where I was just at? You cheeky little... Anyway, there was some stuff back here. I... Had the skip.
I didn't miss anything. Uh, except for the star keys. I thought there was still a, uh... A, uh, block I hadn't opened. Second partner. Just a darn minute, I've seen you somewhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there, Samina. You look a lot like the stellar Mario who's Bell who's on Bowser's what imposter. Now, yeah, what's your name? Luigi, eh? Oh, you do look like this, dude. Well, you're not Mario, I guess. I reckon you can pass. Fun fact, you can put off that fight as long as you want, but you can still get back to it anytime you want, simply by just repeatedly telling Mario or Luigi. He won't uh, attack you until you've uh, said you're either Mario or Princess Peach. Speaking of which, I just want to hit there for a save and a heal. And we can actually see how well or bad we'll do. And we'll just skip right to the decision. Why, I'll be. If you're Mario, I reckon you got to, got to bust you up. Ah, uh, let's see, Tattle. This is bizarre. He guards Mount Rugged. Wow, that's a one big bird. HP 40, attack 3, and 0. He had caught his clutches. Sure, clutch, you lose 4 HP. Try to wiggle out of his grip. His special attack is flapping his wings to great wind. This attack damage your party members too. But he was hatching eggs, wasn't he? Is it possible that he's really a she? I wonder. Ah, some male birds. Uh, play on the eggs. 40 HP. I don't think this is going to go that well. But we can try. do a lot better than that.
Yay, refunds! Uh, well, I guess you're really pissed at this one. Time to use it for uh, that focus with star power. Well, that went a lot better than I thought I was going to, despite all those mess ups. Yow! I got whooped! There's a lot of stuff in this desert. Well, well there, old boy. How goes the travels, eh? I'm known as Colorado. I'm an archaeologist, you know. i am traveled the world. At the moment, I'm turning dry, dry desert upside down to find the dry, dry ruins. My assistants have attempted to gather information on dry, dry outposts, which is near here. Sadly, as of yet, we're having little success. All I need is a clue and we'll be golden. To get to, dry, to the desert town, dry, desert town, dry, dry outpost, just go due east on this path. I'd be careful not to stray from the path if I were you. You may find some trouble and you'll definitely get lost. Even the path isn't that safe, so watch out for your enemies. Assisting Professor Colorado. Right now, we're waiting on the guy who hiked over to Dry Dry Outpost to try and bring back some information. Did you know the people at Dry Dry Outpost are descendants of the makers of Dry Dry Ruins? What a cool thought, huh? People have been living here watching over the ruins for many generations. I guess I can't hit that tree. Oh boy, so... Well, I have not been here, so... Hmm. 
think I should fight those, but, uh, oh well. through this desert bit by bit trees for nothing. This is a bandit! Bandit bump onto your head, uh, bump into your heart, and shoot up your pocket, so you can seal up to 10 coins! Max HP 5, attack power 2, defense 0. Real shy approach, and then slam it to you, uh, into all of you as I did. If you can damage them and the attack, you get your uh, stolen items back! Let's beat them up before they bake off with our loot! That's right. You get nothing. That's mine, thank you very much. Looks like there's a hidden block somewhere, which not an obvious spot. It was a money tree. No bandits here, it looks like.
Oh, let's see. I should actually need yeah, take you off. Oh, wait, I don't have that much. I thought I did. Oh, well. Um... Oh. That'll do. after this row. Something in the back. Metal, please. This is Pokey, and you cactus. Pokey's attack by throwing parts out of their of their bodies or by coming up close and falling on. HP 4, attack 2, defense 0. Be careful fighting them, it will hurt you if you jump on their spiky heads. They also have an annoying habit of calling in reinforcements, so best to beat them quickly. them all. So we get our items back. Uh, 
refresh. Was a lot of ow. And saved. Come on, I had items to store. Hey, hello. I'm assisting an archaeologist, Professor Colorado. I came to Dry Dive Desert to excavate Dry Dry Ruins, but it's hot as places every day and I const I'm constantly thirsty. I want to quit and go home. Just ran off. Welcome, traveler. This is the renowned little mouser's shop of dry, dry outpost. What can we enter you in? I want to check a bunch of items. I want to go in. Ah, Fred Jar can go in as well. I want a fire flower. And a honey syrup. And a mushroom. are in like in these trees and whatnot. Try and hit them. And they will heal at the uh, uh, heal box that is back there. Fellow travelers, I'm in the middle of a journey, just as you appear to be. If you go southeast from here, you'll reach a beautiful desert oasis where lemon and lime trees grow. 
It's nice and cool. It's really the best place to have a rest, but many enemies plague the surrounding area. Do you plan on reaching the oasis in one piece? Be careful. Some of them on that rock. Alright, we're gonna have to start, so let's go back one more and use the heal box. And save. What is this the pop? I thought that was probably just uh, Doom or something. Bandits. Box. Nothing. So that was a bit of waste. Okay, we're just gonna go straight to the bottom. See something on this column. Alright. 
Ah, there was something there for me. God, why are there so many? This is a super block. With this, you can upgrade one of your party members. The member you upgrade will gain the attack power, and the party member will also master a new ability. Which party member do you want to upgrade? Ah, uh, probably Cooper, because he can hit multiple enemies. Yeah. Want to upgrade this member? Cooper is upgraded to Super Rank. Alright, let's check all these trees. There was a heal thing, that's good, because we're gonna have to clear out the area below. to a level up too. Thank you. 
can't suffer Lola. This tree. Okay, I did. And we are on the bottom row, so let's move up one. So let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, we get three more items. One last item. I guess we were only a diagonal from it. Another row of 
Anna. Uh, coins as well. That's this we're taking care of. And that's all the rows taken care of. Let's backtrack to Toad Town to get those two badges before they get cycled out. Thank you. 
Either way, now we don't have to worry about clearing up the desert. Skip it. I knew you would have a keen eye for badges. That's a good one. You need 75 coins for D damn pound. The BP you need in order to use this badge is two. Would you like to buy it? Thanks. I change my stock of badges now and then, so please check back occasionally. shop. I just wanted to jump. Let's see. Here's poisoning. Okay. I'm gonna deposit the lemon and lime. Oh, what else? What else? Uh, Shame that we can only hold 10 items. It would be nice to have double that. Oh, right, we have another seed to give. Let's see. Anything different? Oh, different colored flowers. for the moment. Hopefully that'll be the last time we have to backtrack to Toad Town for this chapter. Just guess I need it. I didn't. Yet, but I am 
I'm not using the N64 controller. I'd rather be, but uh, circumstances weren't working out well that in that regard. But my C buttons are mapped weirdly. Uh, I'm on the. Uh, Bitdo SM90 controller. Uh, most people would map the C buttons to the right analog stick. I didn't. Down is A. Uh, the one that brings up the items, which I think is left, is on X. The other one for the party member is on select, and then. Was it up for status? It's on a auxiliary button. Rather the uh, home button. So let's go back to dry outpost. Dry dry outpost. Uh, find clues. Anyway, the ring is gonna bring up the uh, C button placement assembly because uh, you see me open up the wrong menu. That's why. What I might have to do after the stream is uh, go down to the oasis and bully the bull, uh, bully the uh, bandits that are down there for money. Oh, let's talk to everyone. Welcome, travelers. You must have had a long, hot journey getting here. Welcome to Dry Dry Outpost. Mustafa is the leader of this entire town, so you better keep that in mind. Although you probably won't ever see him. Master Mustafa is the main man. Yeah, Mr. Mustafa is the main man. Oh, Mustafa. Where is the man? Nobody knows. He stays behind and from his foes. Say, is that second degree card? Hey, I have a second degree card too. Oh, awesome. I can't believe that I'm as strong as you are, Mario. Well, I'll get a third degree some point. Well, I won't be too far from here, I just wanted to get a little bit more health points. Have you seen the old fortune teller in Toad Town? He's always right, so his fortune telling is famous! If you hit, you hit trouble in the middle of your adventure, you can act mad to see him. I don't know if that's the shop. I might be going this one. Hey, guess what? Hey, somewhere in the desert there's a stone cactus. If you move three south and two west, from there you'll find something special hidden. Let me write that down, just in case I did not collect where it was there. Because I can't remember which square that was. Not sure how to find it exactly, Harry. You should go there, huh? Yeah. Hey, wanna hear something else? I know lots of other stuff. Use the stuff, hey? Hey, did you know the desert is dangerous? I knew that. If you get caught in a desert whirlwind, it'll blow you away and you'll get lost. Bandits are out there too. They appear all of a sudden running really fast and they'll steal people's coins. There are many tales. You better pay attention to them too, because the desert is an unforgiving place. Hey, wanna hear some more? Sure. Hey, guess what? Uh, here's something not a whole lot of people know. If you go south, just after you leave town, you'll find an oasis. It's amazing, a paradise! I go there sometimes. If you want to take a rest, it's the best place to go. Want to hear something else? You'd be sorry if you don't. I know lots of stuff. Hey, you know what I heard? There are these three trees growing in a triangle somewhere in the desert. I, I... Huh. 
<laughs> so there was actually a hint that you don't need a lot for outside of the trees. <laughs> the rumor is that if you jump in the center of the triangle, you will find something good. Only I don't know where the tr three trees are. I mean, the desert is huge. I can't know everything. Hey, you want to hear something else? We're all hot. I'm loaded with tons and tons of useful information. Hey, guess what? Somewhere in... Oh, you've given me that information already. Your information is dried up. Are you from Toad Town? Well, that's a ways away. I dry ruins? Nope, never heard of it. Sounds like a local fairy tale or something. Hey, if you're serious about looking for dry, dry, whatever, you should go and ask the information chain trader. Supposedly, this information trader lives in town and swaps information for items. Or something along those lines. That's what my friend says. Friend? This guy? Nah, he's way too shy for to be an information trader. My friend is the shyest guy! We can't talk, talk to strangers at all! Just clams up! That's why I usually talk for him, you see! What's that, buddy? You wanna see the princess? Oh, that's a toughie! For that wish to be granted, I think you better wish on the stars, buddy! Hey, you travelers, am I right or am I right? Ah! I don't know, she might actually be willing to invite you. Well, you look important! You dressing me? A composer I am, writing songs. Well, I try. <sighs> I wish there I could find some lovely heart grooving lyrics. I want to compose music filled with beautiful lyrics. It's my fondest wish. Mm hmm. Is it everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo? Want to try the quiz? Then let's go to the question. Question: What is the color of the block that you can break with the first hammer you got? The correct. Congratulations! Here's your star piece. You got a star piece. You correctly answer two questions so far. Good luck next time. We'll be so long. Farewell till we meet again. A brother and sister who are very close to the top shooting star summit. The brother, Marlow, collects star pieces and trade bridges for them. Mr. Sir Marlow is a fortune teller who will tell you where to find bridges. Long ago, in this very land, there was a kingdom called Dry Dry Kingdom. King Mouster ruled over it. One dark, one dark day, he was betrayed by his subjects. In the uprising that followed, Dry Dry Kingdom was ruined. King Mouster escaped and vowed vengeance on his enemies. He gathered those faithful to him and defeated his betrayers. Mouse Master supporters were the original. The King Mouse's supporters were the original robbers and who built Dry Dry a boost. Robbers, you say? Uh, are you sure you're fine to me? Are you going to take a nap anyway? Ah. Uh, please come again. Here, there's an archaeologist named Colorado that is around here looking for dry, dry ruins. You know what? If he digs up the entire desert, he won't find them. Dry, dry outpost was built by robbers long ago. You know, boss of the robbers was the king, was the descent, uh, descendant of a king. The king hid the entrance to the ruins of his kingdom, and the robbers boss guarded them. 
Legend has it that even now, the descendants of that boss hides in this town and keeps the ruins safe from prying eyes. This one casts a spell on you, it might help you during battle. For instance, your attack power might get stronger, or you might get more coins for winning. Other stranger things may happen as well. But do not rely on this spell. By no means will it take effect in every battle. The spell can be beneficial, but it can also be unpredictable. Hello, welcome! How are you? Feeling jelly? Feeling blue? I'm Merle, you see? That's me! A cuter gal you'll never see. I do magic, but not for free. Your luck has steered you well, for I'm the master of this spell. When my spell upon you goes, you might get lucky, but who knows? Do you dare to take chance? Do you want to watch my cards dance? Oh, how lovely. Very good. Now pick one now, if you would. Pay as much as I could. Sure, why not the special course? Well, we're ready, tally ho, and here we go! I think you'll find this power might get your fools to cower. It will light your darkest hour. Even should you beat a beast, do not fear. Not in the least, my spell makes a famine feast. See you then. See you then. See you then. Be please come again. Goodbye, my friend. Ah, uh, we've talked to you already. Seven who gets things is nice. Yes, very nice. Nice guys get told nice stuff. How about this stopwatch? Ah, you give me something. You might be nice. If you're very nice, you give me something more. Ah, fire, fire, why not? I can buy one if I need to. Ah, you give me something. You might be nice. If you're very nice, you'll give me something more. Okay, you get a mushroom. You give me many things. A very nice guy. Yes, very nice. My name is Sheik. I trade in information. Things others do not know. So, nice guy, what would you like to know? You must see, Mr. Mustafa, to find the resting place of Dry Dry Ruins. Mr. Mustafa is a descendant of the great robbers who built Dry Dry Outpost. He is somewhere in this town, yes, but exactly where only his close followers know. I could tell you his secret, but only to the nicest of nice guys, yes. If you still seek knowledge, you must give me something more. Yes, you understand. Thank you for giving me these things. I show you that I'm truly thankful. Let me ask tell you something. Um I thought he was gonna tell me where the uh, Mastafa was, so I'm gonna create a safe state because if he tells me the same information here. Yeah, he told me the same information. So, how about favorite food? My favorite food starts with an L and ends with an N. It's a yellow food. So sour! Such a nice fragrance. So you want a lemon? 
This tree grows only in the desert oasis outside town. If you were to go to the oasis and get me one for me, I might believe you're a true nice guy. Or, of course, only the nicest of nice guys get to be messed off. If you still seek knowledge, you must get me more. Yes, understand? Now, yeah, goodbye. Well, I have a lemon for ya. Welcome, Traveler! This is the renowned Little Master Shop. I'd like to claim, actually. So, which one do you want back? Give me my lemon! Anything else back? No. Let's see, let's give you the lemon. Oh, definitely, a lemon, the nicest of things. You have proven you're nice by giving me my favorite thing. Is this your not so nice? Yes, I'll tell you something really nice. To find Mr. Mustafa, go to the shop in this town. First buy a dry shoe, then a dusty hammer. You must buy them in the correct order. Yes, remember dry shroom first, then the dusty hammer. It's a secret sign known to those loyal of Tumastafa. If you buy these things in the correct order, the owner of the shop will let you see Mustafa. Remember, you must buy them in the correct. You must not buy them in the correct order. You still seek knowledge. Nah, that's enough for now. Dried mushroom. I wish you luck in finding Mr. Mustafa, nice guy. Dried mushroom, dusty hammer. And dusty hammer. Alright, thanks. But who? Buying a dusty hammer after a dry shroom? It's a secret sign from the. That only friends of Mr. Mustafa know. That means you're in with Mustafa. Hey, brother. Good to meet you. Have any questions you need answered? If you want to see Mr. Mustafa, be sure to up on the highest part of Dry Dry Outpost. Just keep going up, my man. Nice guy, we meet again. Indeed, you found me. I'm Mustafa, the one you've been seeking all this time. When I'm out and about in the dry dry outpost, I use the name Sheep. It's always good to meet a genuinely nice guy. You meet people all the time. Well, I meet people all the time, but you are by far the nicest guy I've met so far. Your name is Mario, yes? I heard that you want to go to Dry Dry Ruins. Partly because you asked me. I have a feeling that you uh, are... I have a feeling you are on an important journey, so I'll tell you the secret. The Dry Dry Ruin is a very important place. My ancestors have watched over it for many generations. If I do not... If I do not keep evil folk out of the ruins, who will? 
must promise me that you will tell no one of the secret. I'll give you this. You will receive this pulse stone. The closer you get to try drawing rules, the faster it flashes. This spell stone is the key to fighting dry dry ruins. Take it to the desert, yes. The pulse stone will flash above your head as you get close to the ruins. The closer you get to the ruins, the faster the pulse stone will flash. Follow where it leads you. Find the place where the pulse stone flashes the fastest and use it to open the way. Well, thank you. Recluse, yeah. Yeah. Either way. I might as well check the letters, see how... I know there's one for the Nomad Mouse that's on the way. Oh, we got a letter for Colorado as well. So we'll hit the save. Heavenly Nomad Mouse. Correct. My name is Pericary. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. And another letter duly delivered. A postman's job is never done. Letter to me from Mouse Tapa. I've heard that name, but I forget never who he is. Anyway, thank you for delivering it. I'm surprised you found me all the way out here. It's extremely hot traveling in the desert, so take care. Oh yeah, take this as my thanks. Don't hesitate. Please take it. Thank you. Got one for Colorado. Time again, time and again, bye bye. Oh, sorry, that was not a voice. You know, time and time again, I, my mind returns to an image of the ruins hiding in this desert. I can't speak, I can't sleep. I am quite simply destined to find the, be the one to find them. Here, Colorado, correct. The name is Perry Carey, I did their letters. Just a second. A little ever do delivered. A postman's job is never done. Oh, good show. It's a letter from my wife. Thank you ever so much. This is just what I needed to give me strength to go on. I know. I'll pass this along as a spot of things. I came across a wall as a person in the dig around here. Thank you. I think I know where it's at. I think it's to the north. Oop. My timing is way off. Oh, 
Straight right. Yeah, it's runs right. The question is, how did Bowser find this to put the star spirit in it? But no save? Okay. Koopa, the monster king of the sort. There shall foot in this my palace of the sounds. Speak and be known. Be gone from this place now, or disaster will befall you. Barrio need that all. This is a pookie mummy. Pookie mummies are pookies that dried out and became mummies when they went and went to live in the ruins. HP4, attack 2, and zero. They probably have spikes in their heads, first be alert to jump on them. The mummification process automated made also made them poisonous. You take poison, then you, then when they attack you, they you will take for a while. What do you say we feed them up before they can poison us? multiple times. Let's switch you out back to Cooper. Shield badge, okay. Uh, -ba -bum. badges. Space shield is two. That's, I guess, my next level up will have to be uh, badge points. Thank you. 
down down we go mm -hmm. you got the ruins key open the locked door and try dry ruins hmm. maybe that's an exit Thank goes. I won't go anyway. Uh, can I fall down the hole? Nope. I wonder if I back out here or if those posters will be show up. Let's try that. supposed to be missed. I noticed there was a... I thought it was, for a moment there was film grain, but that's no, that's just uh, some weird mist effect they got going on that room. Four. You explored my worried heart. You fool. I will fall to my... You will fall to my allegiance and become a nummy of the sounds. Okay. Now oh, we can go up, down, or... Middle. That was completely by accident. Oh, they really don't have that much help. Yes, we're going to him again. That way is locked. Well, we must be getting that hammer upgrade. If that's there. Here, another key with presumably sand above. Oh, I guess I just jump in tight. This is a buzzy beetle. Buzzy beetles are cute but mean. HP is three, power, attack is two, and defense is two. Fire attacks won't work very well against these hand hard heads. If you can flip them though, their defense power falls down to zero. Keep flipping them, Mario! I've heard that they used to flourish all over the place, but now they've only now they're only found in dark and shadowy places.
Piece. Still can't fall through the floor. And I got the rune key. And now we go from here. So I presume the hammer upgrade is in here. Something there. So we need to check what that is. This is a super, a ghost bat. Supers got their name because they swoop down out of the shadows. HP is four, attack is two, and defense is zero. Even jump attacks can't reach them when they're up, when they're hanging on the ceiling. But Earth Turtle Tremors will knock them loose. Fairy Care can also knock them loose with one of his moves. You can attack them however you choose once they're hovering in the air. Uh, since I can't hit him with a hammer. Back to Cooper. I should use the, uh... Refresh ability here. I'm going to use this in right now. Did the door open? It did. Oh. 
Foxy Pick, they want to make Care Carry with that. There's also a bottom of a wall. Well, that looks like quite a drop. Either there's a spring underneath it, or... Well, let's see what's up in this room first. Hmm. There's a split in the geometry right there. Wait. No, I don't go in that room. Oops, I mean, I mean, how are you still caught? If you continue over, you'll feel a horrible curse. Okay. Hey, I'm curious. It's a mini puzzle! The Super Hammer! The attack power of Mar Mario's Hammer increases! How about that? You can now destroy stone blocks! I did not check the FP before doing that. Oh. Yeah, I'm down. Unless I get completely missed. Yeah. Nope. That has me being stupid. Oh boy, that's a bit of a backtrack. Just as a friendly reminder, it has been about two decades since I've actually replayed the game until last Wednesday. Oh, of course that item didn't get picked up. That was the wrong one. Compario. So we can get those guys retattled. And we can get the ones below. The ones that I have to fight. you already. Yeah, there 
there's no iron down there. And it's the one above. Rescanned. <sighs> Why? Would've been nice to have that on a boss, but whatever. I just noticed the texture in the doorways. They're just the last pixels stretched, basically. Or rather, I think the next pixel than what's on the edge. just get larger for a split second. Head on with that. Oh, I should have spam. Spin.
Just about where we were. What's in this room? Back. Um, black fist. Your time is running out. Without the treat, you'll be in a great trouble. No, I do not mind. You will regret it. Yeah, yeah. Let's check what's down here. Oh, hey! Hmm. That would be nice. It would be nice if I were to do an extra bit of damage for his box. Sure. Let's get you back upgraded. Well, that's right for down low sec for a second. All right, we're gonna have to come back for that. We are here. There's an item there, there, and there. The purple is the hammer. Huh. Okay, so the hallway there is where we just were. The alert. that text. I didn't do that. Oh well. Ooh. Just getting a closer look at those fires. Those aren't sprites. They're not... Those aren't pixelated. Those aren't sprites in the... Uh... Oh, says... Are they actually generated? Excuse me, I'm taking a look at that. Yeah, 
I kind of want to think they are generated, but they are looping. But the smoothest of the smoothest of the edges of the uh, the orange is a bit too too clean for it to be a. Um, Right. Maybe it's some sort of. Uh, maybe it involves the texture. All right, we're back to the super hammer. Let's get out. Let's go and hit up a save. Uh, after I get this item. have to go back up. Oh! Hello, uh, Trad. I did not see your message till just now. I should... Hmm. I should have got a little audio pop-up and got a message. Oh, so, uh, what's the secret information? I was gonna head that way anyway because I have to get to the uh, artifact that's at the top of the ruins. to the south. Yep, yep, I know where Colorado's at. And I'm assuming to talk to him. Up and left. Oops. Let's see. So, up and to the left. So one loading zone up and one loading zone left. Sure, it wasn't right. Oh, that block, I hit that earlier. Which opened that block. I got a good portion of the uh, desert cleared out earlier. What, for 100 times? Ah. Let me see, just a minute.
So you say it 100 times. Was it just a three? Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, boy. So, that's... Okay, stop. Hopefully there's not too much of a delay. Thank you, I actually did not remember that secret. Uh, it has been about a few decades since I last played this. So, yeah, thank you. Back into the ruins. Author never give Colorado the uh, artifact later. That? Hmm. That's odd. Thank you for the follow. Look at the paddle. This is a stone chop. Who guards the treasure in this room? He's made of stone, duh. HP is four, attack is three, and defense is one. His jaws can supposedly press a coconut. I don't know about you, but I don't want to become a snack. Another item down here.
Uh, this is emulated. Uh, well, I could have been play playing it on the Switch. I don't have the uh, N64 uh, uh, Switch controller. So it's uh, not exactly an ideal setup for me to do it there. Plus, I don't have a capture card, unfortunately. I would have preferred to be able to do it from my uh, N64, the original, but I don't uh, have... I don't have that in storage. I was gonna wait until uh until I got one that N64 controller. Uh Emulation is a bit of a gray area, but as I was gonna say is that uh I would have waited to play any N64 games until after I got the N64 Switch controller. But it never gets in stock, or when it does, it disappears before I can even notice. So, it's the big thing with emulation is that it's uh, more if you're the one that's actually, you know, distributing it to everyone. And that's where it becomes of an issue. But, like, this could be considered as my backup, because I actually do have the game on the original N64. And the law does make exceptions for backups, your personal backups, that is. And then at that point, it's just, you know, Nintendo or whoever has to actually go after the company. It's not simply like the FBI does anything with it until they get, you know, poked by a company. Actually, was it the FBI? It might just simply be handled by the courts in general. That's at least what it seems like lately. Well, 
Not too much of a major issue, really. Alright, let's go back to the map. More, that's where we got one of the items. Ah, a world record with right game. Oh, hello, Dread. How are you doing, Dread? familiar with those games. Is there at least a save point down here? Doesn't look like it. Oh, there we go. This is your final warning. Enough of this foolishness. Leave at once. Warnings. Don't you have some common sense when you get scared and run away? What's wrong with you? You shouldn't mess with the Tuna Koopa. That faithful follower, King Bowser. Oops, I mean, you should. You shall regret this. Jump! Come bite this intruder! Is that a llama chomp? This is a chomp! You've heard about chomps before, I'm sure! HP is 4, attack is 3, and defense is 3! They're made of such hard stuff that most of your attacks only amaze them! I heard a rumor that the chomps are a little peeved at Tutankupa Koopa because he works them so hard.
This is Tooting Koopa. He's one of Bowser's followers, and he's been assigned to guard one of the star spirits. I've heard that he has some sort of barrel complex. HP is 30, attack is 3, and defense is 0. He attacks by throwing shells from that high perch. Try to dodge when he uses magic. His attack power is 12, and it stings for sure. And he also summons chops his loyal subjects. Those chops have some serious attack power. Think hard about who to attack first, Tootin Koopa or Chop. Kinda want to just go after Tootin Koopa, uh, Tootin Koopa first. Genius! Watch and be amazed! I don't have the badge that clings enemies. Ah, what are you doing? That hurt! The king of the desert! You rude, rude man, take this! Ah, should I be been jumping on him again? Choppy. Right, what the hell? Thus, Mario and party unearthed the legendary Dry Dry Ruins deep within Dry Dry Desert. 
They smashed Tutankupa the wizard and freed Mamar the second of the wish granting store spirits. But the enemies await, waiting Mario grow even ever stronger, and the challenges more difficult. What's in store for poor Mario and his f and friends? Where will their adventure take them next? Oh boy. <laughs> Hello, how are you feeling, princess? Nothing makes me happier than a smile from you, Peach. Well, tough luck. I'm in a very bad mood, you monster. You've imprisoned all the guests in the castle. You are the single greatest disaster that has to ever befall to the Mushroom Kingdom. I'll tell you what, I'll smile when you make everything as it was before you showed up. <laughs> That's rich. You know I can't do that. That jerk Mario just beat the Koopa Bros and Toot and Koopa. Sure, they were complete wimps, but they were still loyal to me. I can't forgive Mario for disrespecting me. I'm nipping this in the bud right now. I'm going to use... I'm going to use Invisible Koopa Blubber. Oh yeah. He's the strongest creature I know. After me. You best forget about Mario. Your nastiness. Oh. We have a problem. Boy, Terry Koopa, what got you so riled up? You look upset. What? The star spirit flew away from Tuba Tuba Kluba's castle. Hey, Bowser, keep your voice down. Princess Peach will hear you. Yes, right. Tell me the details over there. Wink, did you hear that? Yes, I sure did. Star Spirit must escape. Did you hear him call that tuba blubba thing invincible? That doesn't sound good. Do you think Mario can win? We better try and find out for about tuba blubba. If we could just find something, anything about a weak point, it might just save Mario. Good idea! Well, there's no time to lose. We won't get anything done if we stay in this room. Careful not get caught. Would help if I had a better look at the room. Guards here too, probably lots of them. Better be extra careful. You're not allowed to leave the room. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to take you back. Are you alright, Princess? Did they hurt you? Yes, I'm fine. Thank you, Twink. That was just plain stupid. I gotta be more careful. It'll be okay next time, Princess Peach. 
And I do not like to make some noise. Oh, at least they didn't let me have to go through the hallway. Let's try this area again. Master Tubba Blubba? I heard a room that he loves eating ghosts. Ugh, ghosts? Huh? Master Tubba Blubba, he lives deep inside Foreigner Forest, doesn't he? I think he's guarding one of the star spirits right now. Yeah, Master Tubba Blubba lives in the castle atop Gusty Gulch. I heard that somewhere near his castle is a mansion in a village full of ghosts. I guess Master Tubba Blubba sometimes goes up there to catch booze. And then, when he catches one, he gobbles it down, starting with its head. Chop! <laughs> oh man, that's so scary. Now I won't be able to walk to the bathroom alone at night. I'm gonna have nightmares, I know it. Why'd you tell me? I also heard that Master Cabobloma is invincible. They say he can't be hurt. Nobody can even scratch him. He might even be stronger than King Bowser. Stronger than King Bowser? Come on, that's impossible. Even Master Tubbola has to have some weak points. It's just common sense. Yeah, you may be right. There's another rumor that Tubbola's got a secret that would ruin him if he ever got out. I bet it's about his past. I heard he didn't used to be strong at all. What if Tubbola hears you? He might gobble us up. Still, what do you think his secret could be anyway? I don't know. No one knows. That's why it's a secret, you half-wit. Twink, it sounds like Tubba Blubba has a weak point after all. I thought that we could find out. Uh, hey, did you hear someone talking just now? <gasps> you think someone knows we're goofing off here? Oh. Whoa, that's a speech. How'd you get here? I'm sorry to do this, but you have to go back to your room right now. Oh no! Oh, no. Maybe I should go and check the other rooms. Oh well. Thank you, Mario. At last, I can head home to the Star Haven. My name is Mamar. I'm so it's so nice to meet you in person. You've still got a long way to go, but I just know you can save Princess Peach. I'll do my best to help you. Here's a present for you. Mario Star Energy goes up by two. Mario can now use Lullaby, a new Star Spirit power. With Lullaby, you can make all enemies fall asleep. Follow me when the times are bad. Leaving this, Mario, my powers are strong. I'm a Star Spirit after all. <laughs> Our powers are growing all the time. Keep up with, keep up the good work, Mario. You must save the other Star Spirits as soon as possible. For now, I'm going back to recover in Star Haven. Who knows how my dear old Star Haven is faring without Star Rod? Goodbye, Mario. I'm off. All right. We have about 30 minutes left in the stream, too, so we have uh, plenty to do. Well, plenty of time to do a few things, anyway.
Mario, if you could see it to have a change of heart, please give me that artifact. Cheers, Mario. Smashing old boy. Soon now, the mysterious dry dry ruins will rise from the sands that concealed him. Excellent brilliant archaeologist, I say it must be so. I suppose I think you get this in order, eh, old boy? Here. Have this. Now, you know... You now know a bit of the magic of the desert. Cheers the memory, old boy. But, whoa, you're Professor Colorado. It's Cooper. I live next to you. It's so great to see you. I never would have expected to meet you, meet up with you in, out here. I'm right in the middle of an expedition with Mario. I want to be an archaeologist like you. Hello there, Cooper. It's been ages. So, if you're serious about taking up archaeology, you and I should go exploring someday. Anytime, really. Or now you concentrate on your adventure with Mario. You'll never attain such fame in archaeology as I have if you don't finish one task before starting the next. Wow, okay. Soon as we're done saving the princess and Mushroom Kingdom and everything, you and I, you know, go exploring. Saved. Back to Toad Town. Oop, that was the wrong path. I was also tempted to just wait until I... until a future party member. The bar was upgraded to Super Rank! I forgot to, uh, 
equip badges after I level them up. down here since this is where I'm heading. Yupa! Another blooper. This is an electro blooper. Electro bloopers are electro charged. HP is 50, attack is 4, defense is 0. Bit of advice, wouldn't there be electricity? It'd be a smart route to avoid contact with them. If you can manage to damage them while they are emitting electricity, they'll go back to normal. Their attack power when they are emitting electricity is 6. Let's say. Let's try to be careful. What do you say? Found a use for that dusty hammer.
read that earlier. It's a Paragoomba! Paragoombas are nasty winged gloom Goombas that make their home in the town tunnels! HP is 7, attack is 2, and its defense is 0. Like Paragoombas, Paragoombas twist their wings and they attack and they fall and become Gloombas! Interesting this time. I'm gonna back out and heal up. What's here anyway? Ah, okay, so that's the desert. should be the uh okay, where would it be? Ah yeah, Kimpa Village. Alright, 
Alright, back to exploring the sewers. Smash Badge. Yes. Hey, is anything I can at the moment? Stop. No, oh, secret wall. That might have been the bar I saw behind the pipe. I saw something behind it. Check up on Luigi. So much for taking care of the fuzzy problem. We, the Cuba Troopers in the village, I really appreciate what you've done for us. We must apologize for not rewarding you with anything. We are but simple Koopas. Please stop by the village whenever you can. It'll be any time. It'll be our honor. Best of luck from all of us. Sincerely, Koopa Troopers as Koopa Village. Could the reach you have gone? Any mail? Nope. <laughs> Trying to think. Uh, health is fine, but we can do the. Try to fight the master. We have about 15 minutes left of the stream. Ah, <laughs> uh, Mario, welcome to our dojo. For what purpose did you come here today? Very well. It's time you fought the master. To battle! This is the master. He owns the dojo, and he's the strongest member. HP is 50, attack is 6, and defense is 0. If he's the best in the dojo, he must be pretty tough. Excellent move. 
Ow. Ultra Mushroom, but at least I get a refund out of it. more hit and here you'll be down. Yay! Master is down. I see why you're so famous, Mari. You are truly a masterful fighter. Very well, worthy adversary. I give you this. You got the third degree card. Proof of Mario's strength for besting the master at the dojo. You are welcome to train here with us anytime. <laughs> Alright. There it is! It's everyone's favorite quiz master quiz, Chuck Quizmo! Wanna try the quiz? Then let's go to the question! Question? What is the reality does Gambario frequently use? Battle! Correct! Congratulations! Here's your star piece! You got the star piece! You've correctly answered three questions so far! Good luck next time! Farewell, so long, farewell, till we meet again! You saw it, didn't you? I'm not the only one! Over there! Now the other way! We went into the forest! I'm a Mario, the badness has to end. Will you go into the forest and see what's going on? I'm ashamed to say it's my job. But I, I just can't go. I'm too frightened of ghosts. <laughs> Please, I'm begging you. Hmm. 
Pardon me, sir. Would you happen to be Mario? How do you do, sir? My master wishes to see you. If you would, please call on us at the mansion on the far side of Forever Forest. My master would also like me to add that she has in her possession important news regarding the star spirits. Please make haste. We shall await your arrival with a warm welcome. And if you don't, I'll come and get you! Brr. Okay. But I think that is actually a good spot to leave off. Uh, it's about seven minutes early, but... Right at the start of the next chapter. I figured it was a good time to end. So, thank for coming to watch it. Uh, we got a whole chapter done today. Which is technically less than last session, which was prologue and chapter one. But that's perfectly fine. We had a whole desert to comb. And we found shit. So, thank you for coming to watch it. Next time I'll be streaming, it will be on Monday. Uh, 4 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Eastern. The VODs go up on YouTube, which there'll be a link in the About section on my page. And... Generally, I stream for four hours, give or take. Considering this is a badly acted edition, it will be, um... Uh... It might be shorter some days, depending on how badly the voices do, you know, affect my throat. Uh... Wednesdays was really bad, even though I did go for the full four hours. Uh, there was a lot of raspy voices. And I tried not doing so many this time. But anyway, um, yeah, I'll be back on uh, Monday, as I said. Uh, I really just need to edit the text on that so that Friday isn't on that list. I'll try to remember to do that post stream. And, yeah. Uh, thank you for Trev for uh, uh, following earlier. And, yep. Hope everyone who came by had a good time. So, I'm just gonna shut up and end the stream in about, oh, 20 seconds. <laughs>